A local businessman has no intention of voting for Donald Trump come November. So why is he featured prominently in a new ad for the Republican presidential nominee? CBS 2's Vince Girasoli went looking for answers in this original report. The sparks are flying at a Skokie Metalworks studio, but not the way they usually do. We're going to be working again. We're going to have great jobs again. I find the ad disingenuous. For four seconds, four workers here are featured in the pro-Donald Trump campaign ad. One problem, owner David Green supports Hillary Clinton. We were in disbelief. Even the people in Donald Trump's own video don't approve of the message that he's promoting. Four years ago, Green and workers signed image releases, allowing a neighboring videographer to take their pictures free of charge. I knew that the images would be put on a stock photo website, but I assumed that they would be forbidden for use in political ads. Skilled craftsmen and tradespeople. The spot is featured prominently on the website of its creator, the pro-Trump pack Rebuilding America Now. It purchased the images from distributor iStock, which limits commercial endorsement use, but doesn't specifically forbid use in political ads. Directors told us their complaint is with the company that's selling the images. We follow the law. Green says the spot also implies his manufacturing firm is struggling when business is stronger than ever. They're using us as the poster child for this video, and I think that that's uh, unfair. In Skokie, Vince Girasoli, CBS 2 News. Vince, thank you. Stock footage and campaign ads is a common practice, says political analysts. The same image of the Skokie workers was used two years ago by a candidate in Oregon. Green didn't complain then because their political beliefs were more closely aligned.